the graphics team transformed me into 11-year-old Bailey. Bailey is afraid of the dark. She hasn't had her first crush yet. She's still prepubescent. A parent might assume Bailey would be insulated from any sort of predatory attack. We launched our 11-year-old persona online. 444 and go. One like from a guy whose profile photo <gasps> is a penis. One, one, so let's say, one minute and seven seconds. We have a message request. Although this, sorry, two more requests just came in. How much time? A minute and minute. 40 seconds? Yeah. How old, How old are, you? are you? You go to the profile, you know that that is a child. It also says in the profile that the child is in sixth grade. Another one. It's just lighting up, like the inbox is just boom, 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 boom. An incoming video call in less than five minutes. I can't see you. Don't be shy. They all say don't be shy. Few parents know just how dangerous these platforms are for so many kids. So we brought some on site so they could see for themselves. 11-year-old Bailey's persona was approached with an even more disturbing level of manipulation and requests. While the majority of the abuse happened from a distance, our child profiles also received requests to meet up in person, especially our 15-year-old persona. 28-year-old Keith was relentless. Like the others, he took no issue with Libby's age 